up for sale from Redvale RV is this freshly traded Atomix 600 boat. We've traded this boat in here at the yard. Purpose of this video is to give anybody at home a good idea of just how great this boat is. I'm gonna go over it, uh, I'm gonna point out any marks or anything I can find. So I've personally taken this boat across to Turi Island. It went absolutely beautiful. Then took it down to Lake Oakuri and we used it for four days down there. Gave it a really good run to make sure everything's working as it should be. It's fitted with an electronic windlass. Beautiful LED lights on top there. It tows beautifully behind the vehicle. It's got a trailer that's designed for this boat. So it sits brilliantly on the, on the road. It's also got all of its covers. So I'm just gonna try and get the whole boat in. The boat's in really lovely order. And the motor runs absolutely beautifully. It's got trim, trim tabs on the rear there. It's got an onboard deck wash pump. It's got a couple of live bait tanks. Got a fish finder. Externally, it's in really, really good order. Couple of tiny marks in the paintwork. Is there. I'm, I'm guessing that it'll all just buff out. But it's just, yeah, phenomenal order. Trailer, trailer's in great order as well. Got the spare tyre. All the tyres are in good condition. Chassis is really solid. All those rollers are in really good nick as well. I'll try and stand up here. Right. All right, I'm going to jump on in. Oh, before I do, the trailer's also plumbed, so you can wash your, your wheel bearings and your brake systems out. The trailer's got a warrant and rego. You see the outboard motor, it's in good order. It's got a cover that goes over the top of that. Fold down ladder. I'm going to jump on in. So it's got LED lighting inside the cabin as well. Removable fish chopping board. There's cup holders all around. More rod holders up the top there. Another light. I'll just start at the rear here. There's seating for four at the back. Underneath these floors are all tanks. Does have a self-draining deck and there is a deck wash hose that you plug in there. Hit the pump button and you can squirt everything down. Cup holders are tucked away in behind these little jobbies here. Now this cable here, it does all work, but you can see there's a little bit of sun damage to the cable. Min Kota trim, ta trim tabs, all of our controls here for the windlass, our accessories, etc. Hummingbird fish finder worked well. back so you seat two in the cabin got the clears up there and the glass windows below so you can open up that clear into the front lounge I suppose you could sleep in there but it'll be very snug and it's got lighting in here as well there's also a cover that goes over there so you can cover that area there. A lot of storage in behind all of the seats and our battery control and fuel stuff's all in here. So it's got a start battery and a house battery. This boat was one of the easiest boats I've ever had to, to use. The only thing that didn't work was the fusion radio. It does not work. Other than that, you could jump in this boat tomorrow. 
and as long as you had plenty of gas in it, you could have a very good day out. The outboard is a 150 horse V6 two stroke. And there you go, so we can arrange finance if you need. If you want to come and view, it's based at our yard here in Redvale, just north of Auckland. Jump onto our website, www.redvalerv.com. Look forward to you calling.